What? To, 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 to a Cami player named Powell. Fudo? All right, I got to talk about Fudo. That's actually ridiculous. Right, are we well actually we going here? Win. Welcome uh, back to EVO. Let's Japan. go. Fudo. 18. Fudo with the W. Finish it off the game. Go. All right. I have to tell you guys. Oh, man, don't tell me that was the last God that crap, man. Fudo wins. We need some modern technology. Yeah. We need to go back and be able to watch the goodness of uh, Fudo Is that winning. possible? No, uh, probably no. not. I blame Hanzo. Yeah, yeah, it's probably Hanzo's fault. Welcome Fair back enough. to EVO Japan 2018. We got to see the tail end of Fudo winning there, but we didn't get to see Tokido losing is what I keep Tokido hearing. Tokido did not lose. Bre that's the, that's the, the word on the streets. Yeah, I keep is hearing. Is that fake FTC news or is that the real thing? There's I'm fake not actually FTC. Sure. There's definitely fake FTC yeah, news. I'm actually not <laughs> sure, but I keep people keep telling me that he has been put into the loser's bracket. I'm not sure if that's true or not, but if so, dang. It's tough out here in these streets. Things are getting dangerous. Yo, the cup noodle shirt's being Yo, advertised behind me. Can I get one me. of that? The cup noodle shirts? You trying to get one? <laughs> look at him. He's he's fighting for these it. These guys. These guys. I don't blame him. Oh, oh look at that. Oh, oh, you Z can literally be a ball. walking meme. Yeah, I'll show yeah. it to this later. Macho Bo. Rocking the collar. He, of course. I guess he lost in uh, Guilty Gear to Ogawa in Kimonomi. No, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. The light, Fighter. The light defeated the darkness. <laughs> yes. wow. Look, all I know, is, I don't know why you're talking about Guilty Gear. There's two Street Fighter players on the stream. You right? no, neither of these players have ever played Guilty Gear in their wow. lives, as far okay. as wow. I'm concerned. Rising star. Rising don't defend star. Kai players on my watch, all right? You know yeah. better than that. Don't talk about Kai players in front of me. But Machibo right. is looking good, though. Machibo is He's looking, looking, looking just like nice. the Street Fighter player that he is. Gets the low forward, EX stomp. Machibo moving forward in that winner's bracket. Can't believe he got beaten so badly in one game that he had to come down to another. Z, shut up. Stop hating on my boy, man. <laughs> Ogawa said, all right. <laughs> resurrected Tokido from yes, the loser's yes, bracket? Yes, yes, Yukadon versus Taiga is the match we have on our screen uh, okay. screen here. So assumedly Yukadon Ibuki, I would guess. Of course. And he's using the uh, giant shuriken blade from Naruto, <laughs> V-Trigger 2. Yeah, baby. sien has been uh, experimenting with that as well. The right. There it is. Shuriken, there we go. The reset back off Medium this. punch into, yeah, you, oh, it's very difficult to get to the back. So I don't treat that as a true 50-50. Mm, okay, yeah, I think the mix-up is just throw a strike there, basically. Yeah. Oh. What? He gets right, right through it. Uh -oh. Stunner. And that's going to be the first game? Uh, I believe that's I uh, know that's Yukonon. Oh, that's Yukonon? Number one stunner. Yukonon moves on. Yeah, so everything we just saw was replays, right? So we okay. just took a look okay. at a bunch of replays that happened during that break. You got All to see right. the tail end. So Yukonon moving on in winners. Uh, Fudo moved on. Machibo moved on. We don't know the status of Tokido. The rumor is is that he was put into that loser's bracket, but it's hard to know He probably here. got dq Like, the chances of him getting dq are <laughs> higher than him losing. Because they do not give top player privilege here. They definitely don't. I heard a story that... Daigo us. got dq would from his own Red Bull tournament. Wow. What? Yeah, he's like, you're a global ambassador? Nope, you're a one minute late. Range is way too happy about this. He's like, that's what he gets. Inside, he's crying. He's you like, know, I heard that at uh, Akihabara, the eSports yeah. square, that... <laughs> Sako and Haitani got turned away because there was too many people, and they said, "Ah, oh, you guys can't answer." Oh, you fighting game gods, two of the five. Uh, uh, no, uh, no, please wait. <laughs> a plague wait upon your Street Fighter houses. No, just <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we see right, Mena and Tokido, 9 a.m. pools, baby, no privilege. Yeah, none what at all. What is you that, got that philosophy? Why are we not glorifying our celebrities in the FGC? These are just video games, they're bro. Just there's video no games. celebrities. Yep, that's, that's why Smash? we don't glorify. They're just other players, uh, bro. Gods? No Smash, they deserve it though. Those guys. <laughs> What? The hand warmers? They deserve, they need the hand warmers. Have you not seen a GameCube controller? You, you get arthritis instantly. You try to wave dash at one of those bad boys, you're done. Yeah, those things are not that, made that, for, those the, are dangerous. for the stuff you have to do on that thing. I don't know. I can't imagine trying to play on it. I, I, play, I played Sunshine on it, and I was like, man, this thing is there. It hurts exactly. my hand. Hold on. Can I take a second? <laughs> <It's a Mario laughs> game. It hurts my hands. <laughs> How am I supposed to play this? Show you Bam. the future of streetwear. <laughs> you can be a walking noodle. Bam, 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 bam. Let me stop. All right, let me. Well, I'm I did see DJ Logan Sama earlier, and I know that's his favorite noise for I sure. I said that, and he actually turned around. He's like, somebody's summoning me. He was yeah. like, somebody's summoning the Logan Sama. Either way, guys, thanks for tuning in here. Evo Japan. The first of many, I hope. Uh, I'm having a good time. We've already seen some amazing matches. We've uh, we just looked at a couple of the replays from what's happened during the break, and I'm not sure how many people we have here, but apparently the numbers are really good. Man, you know, I looked down an hour. Tokido oh. lost to Powell. That's what it says. A station in San Francisco, <laughs> right before Montgomery. This has to be <laughs> fake news from the NorCal. Is that on the Bart? <laughs> yes. You assume the NorCal uh, you production think that team. JR Yamanote line is going to lose to the Bart? Wow. No. Wow. Uh-oh, right, here take, we go. Take these arms. Catch these hands. Catch <laughs> these hands. Catch them outside. One round up.
No, my dude's throwing like rockets? I told you, man, he shot uh, missiles off his hand. Dang, we have USA, USA. Whoa! An all Gaijin match here in Evil Japan. Ugh, oh, he is getting jammed in his corner, though. You got to get out of there. This is like real boxing. Yeah, you got to. Yeah, he's got him against the ropes. Oh, reversal so super, super big damage. Okay. Yeah. And see, uh, Super is charged up in the bottom right there, that glowing triangle. But does it even matter at this point? Valhalla the lead does not oh, get over dodging. here. Oh, man. Yo, that two hit Shinsho Yuka right there? Uh uh. Oh. Oh. Just got clipped right there. Yeah, when he was against the wall, I was expecting back four uh, Jet Upper, but instead, <laughs> just does the Super instead. And uh, closes it out. The US of A winning in something yeah. here at Evo Japan. That's, that's what I'm talking about. Let's go, arms. It's our best chance. This may have some DLC. I haven't seen that character before with the three rockets. The rockets? That oh, it's, just, it's, just, it's just a glove. It's yeah, like you yeah, can customize each. I know oh, I've seen it before. Wow. Yeah. I've seen that one before. Yeah, there's the rocket gloves. They have the spread on rocket it, but punch. it's just got to recover. <laughs> Need to get McGregor that punch. He said the McGregor. <laughs> he needs to get McGregor. Needs to get one of those. Yeah, uh, is he? He has a fight coming up or something, doesn't he? No, he's, he's too rich for that nowadays. <laughs> Dang. You uh, imagine hitting that point in your life where you're like, I don't want to get beat up anymore, yeah, dude. I got too much money. Come on. Oh, it man. makes sense. Someday, one of these fighting game players would be like that. One day, to some, Tokido will be like, I got too much money. I'm, I'm not, not trying, trying to, to lose the I power. I hope we get to that <laughs> point. I heard Menard is at that point after the conversion from US dollars to pesos. Yeah. He's like, literally a millionaire. There. He has, yeah, like the conversion rate is, is like 12 million Dominican pesos or something like that. It's crazy. He could live in his villa and like live out the narcos life, but he came down here <laughs> to defend his championship. And I think it's really important because if I were the champion of Capcom Cup, I would just sit and not give a chance for anyone to dethrone me. Bro, just I never would hold again. that for yeah. the whole year. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're holding that forever. Let me yeah. get that rich. In the, in the DR, bro, I'm going to buy a solid gold mansion. I'm telling you right now. And it's going to be statues of me <laughs> gold as mansion? you walk in. What do you mean a gold mansion? And like my a doorbell will be ba da 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 <laughs> Yo, it better be that Japanese heated toilet seat, though. Oh, that's look. golden heated toilet seat. The only thing that gets me heated is watching Nemo play, all right? That's all I want to oh, hear. Oh, yeah. God, cool. man is on this the is a salary man. He just announced that he joined Square Enix. He's that's a dream job, the by the way. That's a dream job, by the way. The only, the only dream is Nemo. That's, that's all I'm saying. My man, you saw that handshake. The handshake heard around the world. All Speaking right. of the handshake, it's now an emote in the Evo channel. I yes. heard about it's that. It's an extended hand. I think it's Evo like hand. Or I, I, man, look, first off, I wanted to say that was some of the most vicious, uh, like, thuggery I've ever seen. Oh, um, the <laughs> gentleman <laughs> chivalry thuggery? If, if y'all saw me in the front row of Capcom, I was actually just screaming the whole time. I was like, eat as I leave. <laughs> get out of there. Get out of there, bro. Oh, the, another oh, so much gray life on the side of Yeah, he's been hit by like three of your reversals, I think. Oh, oh. charge fears. Oh, oh. oh, no. Why would you do that? EX plus frames. Oh, oh. the dolphin died. Dolphin died. Free catching Willy. everyone. I'm going to take this chance to fix my face earlier. In the losers finals, Men RD actually 3 0 Nemo in this same matchup. Yes. So we'll see. Atlas Bear is that new esports team that's been scooping up talent around the world. We don't know much about Atlas them. Atlas Bear. Atlas Bear. But, uh, world Bear. Pungo, like Pungo's on that team. Oh, the charge. Double? Yeah, he's got that V-Scale charge up too, so Checking you can't really plasma. jump because of the uh, the armored headbutt. Yeah. Oh, didn't even let him drink the can. Yeah, no Red Bull for you. Doesn't allow it. Charging up that V-Scale again. This is a bad spot. Oh, oh unless you have bar. Reaction <laughs> to projectile. I'm surprised Nemo's using uh, V Trigger 1 because he's been raving about V Trigger 2, the tyrant, well, and how broken it is. Because it's, it's, right now it has a bug. It, it, oh, yeah, there's a bug on it. But I think Mirror is more consistent. And I think it's better in this matchup, too. Um, Birdie's not going to be jumping around all too yeah. much, and I feel like that's one of the better uses for uh, Urien's trigger, too. I feel like any situation in which you can put a mirror on top of Birdie, especially considering oh. uh, 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 that he's going to keep doing this, you need to stop it now. <laughs> Interrupting yourself with the sound effects was too good. <laughs> That's how Steve does things. <laughs> Gonna hit him with the, oh my, man, I, oh man. Oh man. It's He's gonna cool. be so much, oh. <laughs> And that's the main thing. But that's not even the main thing. <laughs> charge round. <laughs> Takes the guaranteed V reversal on the uh, charge roundhouse. It's a good choice. You don't want to deal with those oh. plus frames. Jump out. Ooh. Yeah, you get a full punish. Oh, wow. That was a mistimed juggle. It's one of those Square Enix combos, you know? <laughs> Which work? He probably came from work today. Yeah, he, got, he released. This is actually his lunch break or whatever. <laughs> that would like, be so crazy if you won a tournament in your lunch break. Oh, in the front, he wasn't ready for it, and that spaces him out for the forward strong after into another EX fireball or into a headbutt. So, yeah, Nemo was ready. Oh yeah. 
A little good little recovery there at the end. Not so bad. Yeah, you know my man did his research after the whooping he got from Mena. And, uh, yeah, of course, probably not playing as a uh, top of the caliber as Birdie as he did at Capcom Cup. Oh. There's yeah. always something to learn, though. You know, that's, that's something you have to remember. Every, uh, every L is still a lesson, you know? Absolutely. And you see, Nemo's been consistently punishing the sweep with the EX tackle. Didn't have bar that time, so he yeah. got away with it. Exactly, right? As soon as you don't have meter, you lose that ability. Oh. Oh. Tried to space out the tackle so he could get uh, forward medium punch after, but a little late. Almost got that counter hit combo. EX didn't have the projectile invincibility in time. Oh. Oh, oh. tries to get over the can. Oh, oh. A little too far. He piloted it too forward. I like Nemo jumping right back out of that corner. Oh, to keep. what? And this is what I was talking about. Nice. Jeez. Yeah, another V reversal. Doesn't want to deal with it. Elbow out of there. It's got the confirm. I got the counter hit on the first one. V skill up again. It's so useful in this matchup. It allows you to headbutt those jumps anytime he tries to get over a fireball. Oh, oh still has one ages? mirror left. Yeah, he almost used it to punish that uh, activation. But here, Nem Nemo's hitting in a great position. Yep, nice. exactly. And he hopped right over the can, too. Uh -oh. Brilliant. On the ground. Set up. Jump. Oh, I knew it. After him. I knew it. The can's coming. The cross up. Oh, oh jump back air. jab. Yeah, he was out of there. Didn't want to deal with that situation at all. That's definitely what you want to do. That's awesome. We've seen Mena do that exact same thing to people. Reset, jump over, cross up mid-screen, and e Nemo was like, nah, not today. Oh, just punches the fireball with the cross jab. EX tackle. Target in the corner, trying to fight oh. his way out. Too late. Right oh. back in there and over the can. Great stuff from Nemo. Yeah, EX knees. Pretty good option, actually, to get over the can. Oh, I thought it was a uh, me. Maybe he thought it was counter hit, actually. V reversal doesn't want to deal with it. There's no bar on Birdie's side either. Whoa. Just does it anyway. V skill out of there from Nemo. That was so good. Following the can with the EX. That way he has to change up that option if he's going to answer back. Oh, punish. And as you brought up earlier, that sweep. Yurian does have a punish if he's got bar with that EX tackle. Incredibly fast. Really useful in that kind of scenario. Dang, Nemo teaching him how to desync the pad. But we're jumping right over to arms. K. Hey, oh. Dang, just like that. Uh, that was probably the toughest arms commentary I've had to do all day. I was gonna get a little analysis. Oh, oh this Gumby the Jello Man. Cactuar. That's a, that's a Gumby, uh, Gumby's like next evolution form. You yeah, like the, the DNA off the arms. Yeah. All right, sorry, this is a stupid question. Can you kick an arm? Yeah, dude. What? No, you can't. Why would you be able to? Because <laughs> Boxer can, like, has a kick, doesn't he? Wait, I, wait, Boxer really? has a kick? You know, he, he, has, a he has one, he has a stomp. Yeah, he stomps yeah, he on stomps, people. Yeah. So, like, maybe that's one <laughs> exception. No, I mean, Steve Fox, he kicks. Him okay, so is stomp. there, are there, can you kick in arms? No. Still can't the kick way in Steve arms. set him up, <laughs> the way he set him up, I just, I knew Steve was lying too. Just, no. Yeah, of course. <laughs> just checking. All right, no, look. That's, that's a good question. If you guys are confused about any of the games you've seen today, ask everybody in the chat. I'm sure they'll be more polite than Steve was. <laughs> I'd buy DLC kicking. I was going to say, legs, legs, legs will be DLC. Boy legs will be DLC. No, no I'm DLC. telling you, there's going to be, you're not ready for the, the sequel. Kicks. Legs. Legs, kicks. Oh, legs yeah. dude. Legs and kicks. That's all it's going to be. Chun Li is going to be in it. Yeah, the DLC character. There you go. It's guest character. Chun Li versus Huarang. You heard it here first. Nintendo's about to get that license. They got the money. That'd be pretty cool, actually. <laughs> oh, yeah. In arms. That'd be sick. You know what's going to happen. Probably before Tekken Cross Street Fighter ever happens. Man, I hope not. I want this Tekken Cross Street Fighter, dude. I'm telling you How right now. How long are you willing to wait, though? Look, How many long? years? Not much longer, guys. Come on now. <laughs> I'm getting old. You see all this gray? I'm still getting old, There's right? no way that one company can be producing, you know, the Dragon Ball, they got Tekken, they got Soul Calibur, and on top of that production cycle, put, like, Tekken Cross Street Fighter? Do you think they have that much manpower? But if you look at, like, Tekken 7 and what it's done for the characters that it's brought to the engine of Tekken, like, they've done a spectacular job. Oh, yeah. Like, Akuma being in Tekken, and then you get Geese in Tekken, and then not including my boy Noctis, I'm just saying. Yeah, they've done such a good job transferring these characters over, right? Geese is so much fun to play. Akuma, everybody's just, at the same time, is feeling faithful. They're so much fun to play as Tekken characters. So just imagine okay. if we get our Tekken Cross Street Fighter and Yurian's in. Just saying. They doesn't fit in with the lore. Bro, Why not? Tekken Cross Street Fighter is not. It's okay, right, 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 right. Can you but imagine counter hit Laundry standing, standing fierce right there? Boom, counter hit Laundry. I probably would be upset. Dash up, I, elbow. I, I think I would be mad. Like, if I get hit by, like, a tyrant slaughter and Tekken, I'm going to be like, man, 
I'm gonna flip the table and I'm leaving. He's got Aegis. You're trying. You gotta sidewalk the Aegis, bro. Actually, that's what I want to know. How that wide sounds, is Aegis? That actually sounds amazing. Now, now that you say that, that sounds pretty sick. You have to sidewalk, knock down eggs, wake up with sides. Oh, that's sick. All right. I just oh, sidestep in real life and I went too far. <laughs> yeah, yeah he, ste he stepped over here. That would be so sick. I'm oh, down man. for it. You don't I'm hear any complaints from me. <laughs> Imagine Nemo happen. playing Tekken wow. with Yuri in. I'm about that. I'm all about like bridging that gap of mm. having all. That's that's one of the reasons I'm super hype about Dragon Ball. I want people to to bridge that gap and kind of you know unify everything that we do here in the fighting game community. And I personally feel like there's nobody that doesn't like Dragon Ball. Even if you don't like Dragon Ball, you like Dragon Ball personally. Yeah. I mean, just look at L.I. Joe. He's like, oh, I'll do this Dragon Ball stuff. And I was like, yo, I love this game. Send me tech. I'm he watching the show. He did a 24-hour stream. Exactly. Yeah, I fell asleep when I woke up. I was like, is this a, a replay? He was still going at it. <laughs> oh, wow. So we go back to KOF right now. Oh, wow. Angel. My girl, Angel. So many, so oh, yeah, it's a lucha, she's like a luchador or something, right? Isn't she? Yeah, she's, just, she's like a wrestler. Has a, she has chains. It's, she's actually really cool. And oh, she has chain throws, right? Yeah. No, she has chain special moves. She has like punches. Yeah. Oh, here we go. That's oh. part of it. She gets small loops in this, too. Oh, the punch. Yeah, the loops. Reset. Try to go for the mini. Yeah. the overhead. Yo, and hell. Oh, you're done. Wall bounce. What? Yo, that character. The other player didn't get to play, and he's sponsored by Sanwa. Yeah. He didn't even get to press a Sanwa button the whole time. <laughs> he was just holding down back on the yeah. Sanwa lever. The lever. <laughs> That's all there was to it. Yeah, they have a new stick out Sanwa, actually. I saw it. Uh, I saw you trying to pre-order through Mark. <laughs> I was trying to pre-order anywhere. I, I made a blanket tweet. <laughs> oh, Stanby. Oh, side the, switch? Yep. And that input for that super is really weird. It's like backwards DP. Yeah. <laughs> it's really weird. I thought it was going to be like pretzel, but like something weirder. Wow. Yeah, those KOF yeah, inputs. There are pretzel motions in KOF. Pretzel, the pretzel, I realize what a pretzel input is now. I never understood what it was until I tried to fit myself in a Japanese shower. <laughs> and I was like, damn, this is what the pretzel input is? I can't fit in here That's at all. Sound like Mr. Baseball. It's crazy, <laughs> Look, man. You're five, so five, ten? No, you're not fitting in a Japanese shower. Well, Somi still cannot crack over this on hell. Gets the back throw. Yeah, the thing about, the well, thing about Angel is the fact that she can cancel into stances back and forth. And she can roll through you in some of these instances. So you have to be careful. Oh, oh tries to go for the counter. Gets yeah. baited. Headphones. Yo, she can come on the super off that if she gets it too. So mm -hmm. good, uh, good bait. Noise canceling headphones. Life canceling. Headphones. Yeah, that's true. Oh, the goose. Geese. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, put Tekken characters in this game. Yeah, you got me. So, that was good. You got me. He was so excited. That was so good. Yeah, put just put a bunch of Tekken characters in this game now. Wait, huh? is this the zombie version? No, nah, no. Nah, okay. Nah. You'll know when it's the zombie version. Trust oh. me. Oh, get I can't believe he's got an OTG after a fireball. It doesn't make any sense. Do you see that pose he does? He actually Stand does up. that in Tekken too. <laughs> Double yeah. right. He's like a dunk. <laughs> <Stunned up. laughs> this character's so tight. Yo, this character actually makes me mad. Who? Geese? Geese or Zarina? Oh, Zarina. You played uh, Reynold too much, man. Yeah, she's got the true. 6B. Oh, God. Oh, gets opened up. Let's go, Geese. You know, I'm not really a fan of bad guys, but I love Geese. Geese is so tight. Tries for the overhead block. That's Ooh, the 6B we were talking yeah. about right there. Goes so far. Allows for easy cancel in the max mode. Safe on block. Mm -hmm. Yo, even his run is sick. <laughs> what is Jinko jeans? I trip all over myself. <laughs> Yeah, those jeans are getting steep. <laughs> those jeans are killing oh, me. Oh, gosh. Ugh. 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 I, you know, I bet you there's like five. Ooh. There's probably so many Tekken players in the chat yeah. watching right now. Wall like, bounce. Look at like this. Rooting. Ooh. Oh, my. What, what is this? Is this? Yeah. Yeah. What? It's exactly what, what I'm doing? talking about. I told you. The, the, six the six B. I told you, man. So what is this character doing? Somebody said help. You guys know that that's a real vortex right there. You're like, what side is it? Oh, my God. Six B again. Yeah, you see, he's you're even using meter. Guard cancel blowback. Doesn't want to deal with that situation. But this from character is crazy. <laughs> She's trying to get in again. Oh, oh no. so good. We were not kidding about that you move, You think I'm man. playing? Randall that is the move for this character. He actually thought it was funny to hit me with that, but he's like, oh, this is sick. <laughs> I don't know what you guys were talking about, and all of a sudden I was having Elena flashbacks. Oh, I saw the Gong dancing. Il. Yeah, Gong Il is serious, too. Talk to me about Gong Il. <laughs> My man's definitely got some buttons, can mm. convert with big damage. Oh, Ugh. Oh, try for the overhead. Not going to happen. Kim Kaplan's master, man. Yes. <laughs> Wait, you mean his name is Kim Gong Il? <laughs> 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 Is that real? 
I guess. Is that actually his name, Steve? Oh, well, that's, that's triggering Hawaii He's right now with Cam's, the false alarms. Kim Capwan is a character. That's the guy who trained him. Okay. <laughs> false alarm. It's not a big deal. We're, we're, uh... All right, so I got to pose a question. If you get that warning sign on your phone that the, it's, a, it's a missile alert and you're in Hawaii, there's nowhere to run, what are you going to do? <laughs> For what? the last 30, 30 minutes of your life. I'm probably going to watch the match we have play on, video our, games? on our stream right here. Z, yeah, I'm probably going to watch Zengi versus I'm probably Balrog. just going to keep playing video games. Balrog yeah, being Vegas. Degenerates. Yeah, of course. I know what I'm doing, Z. Oh, wow. All right, here we go. <laughs> so we have a Vega. Oh, it's Kichibamo. Kichibamo. Oh, sorry. A claw. A claw. Play. We're going to go ST style. We got a claw versus Gi. All right. Already. B trigger two for the Geef as well, giving him some extra damage on the SPDs as well as allowing him to combo into it. Yo, the activation pose for uh, trigger two for Geef is actually pretty powered up. I'm, I'm about he also it. gets his custom announcer. Yo, the announcer is so I am distracted. I'm like, shut up back there. <laughs> and like the ultimate dynamite attack. I'm like, shut up back there. <laughs> I want to hear about it. It definitely reminds me of ultimate. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, it's not looking good. Not looking good. Get done. Give me a little meter. Ariato. Ugh. Oh, nice uh, backdash on the throw, but still eat this SPD. Get tucked oh. in. Good night with the perfect. Yeah, oh. Perfect there for Kichipamu, who uh, top eight of Japan Ooh. Cup. Saw that a little while ago. One of the younger, uh, really powerful generational players here in Japan, right? Super young, really talented, bright future ahead of him. Dash up. Man throw. That stand fierce. Oh, what a neutral jump. Look at this. Nice. Offense get dumped again. Really close to stun. Overhead? No. All right, maybe the future's not that bright for him. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, that into the back. That's not good. Oh! Yo, you see that belly flop cross up? Oh, oh comboed into it. Look at the damage. Oh! oh. 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 oh this trick in the book, known by the youngest player in Japan. And even if you weren't dead. It still would have been stuck. Yeah. Yep. That's all there is to it. It doesn't matter what you do at that point. Life just gets real tough. Yeah, Kichipom, I think, also sponsored by Atlas Bear. Oh, oh picked okay. up part of the Atlas Bear crew. I don't know what they do. I don't know where they get their funds from, but they're scooping up a lot of talented players. Punko as well. Kichipamu. Yeah, Punko is here, right? I think so, yeah. Are they a uh, Japanese sponsor? All right. Atlas. I don't oh, know. more Blaze Blue. Okay. Oh, Subaki. This character's actually sick. Goes right into overdrive. Oh, wow. All right, let's see what's going to happen. And I, I, I'm not familiar with how her uh, gauges work now, but they, I believe they charge faster. She used to go really slow to get access to these other moves. So the further along she goes, she gets more projectiles, more moves. Knockdown in the corner. Back to level one. Oh, wake up DP. Yo, this character's actually ch cheap, dude. Izayoi is actually really cheap. And oh, I yeah. think they, uh, she was considered one of the best characters in the game for quite some time. That's the thing that's cool to me about uh, Blaze Blue is that every character has kind of their own mechanics, right? They're so every unique. Every is different. The yeah, yeah, they're all so unique uh, that it's kind of like every character has their own system mechanic that they just kind of get to employ. So, like, it's really hard to not find a character in this game that you find interesting. Yeah, they have all every character. The input for this game is A, B, C, D. D is your drive button. So every time you see a unique attack, chances are it's done with the drive button by the character. Back in the overdrive. And you have burst as well as overdrive in this game. And acti activating overdrive definitely gets you way too much damage. I ain't going to say way too much, but you have to be careful. Defense is key. Oh, The other side. Uh, full screen cross-up. Did Juna say that didn't exist in anime games? What are you talking about, Juna? It's, it's a full screen game. overhead. Say it was a cross-up overhead. <laughs> Same, Same thing. thing. <laughs> A different direction on the joystick, man. Come on, Juna. How many oh, strongs nice. in were you when you said that, huh? <laughs> oh, what a throw tech. Yeah, and the dash gets interrupted. Yeah, crouch A just to start off this combo. Like, really playing a lot more compact this Izioi. Yo, Meg Meg Tsubaki is going, is, is not going the way he wants right now. She has an overhead mix up in that situation too. And in this game, overheads are, are there's a lot of overheads that are a lot slower just so you can get a chance to react to them. Yeah. Um, the neutral game in, in this game is very, very scary, like I said before. Damage output for most characters are really high. 25 to 35, uh, 3500 is what you want to get for basic damage in this game too. 
Yeah, we mentioned it earlier. Once you get put on the defense in this game, you have to deal with so many situations. The mm -hmm. half screen cross up overheads that we saw earlier is mm -hmm. it's not rare. Izzy Yoi. Finish. He plants the sword in the character. ground. Izzy Yoi is tight. I like this character. Man, she this looks character cool. is annoying. She looks really cool. All right, I think they're getting set up for the second game. But I also think our Akune looks cool. Just visually. I know you got everybody despises that character. Have you ever fought that character, bro? No, I just think he looks cool. That's why you see? Ooh. All right. I want to see. I want to hear that tune after you fight him. I probably play him. <laughs> oh, wow. Pick up. And that's really strange to me that Izzy Oye can pick up after knockdown, switch side. Oh, wow. Here it is. Oh, the same Ooh. side reset. That was amazing. Working on a perfect right now. Meg, Meg, you're in trouble. Help. <laughs> Help. 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 Yo, hell? endless walk oh. mode. All right. <laughs> Help was not sent. Are you sure the offense is strong in this game when you get knocked <laughs> down? I'm not exactly sure. Well, you have different tech options in this game. Like, you can do delayed tech, you can lay on the ground, and you can roll forward or back. So if they read that, that was what she did. She actually read was like, oh, you're going to probably roll back. So you go to the other side, and you can OTG pick up for a full combo. Um, oh, my goodness, the overhead reset. Okay, blue combo. That's not a real combo. Now let's see. Same side again. Oh, wow. See this? Look at this. See, what? Yeah. Team side low? Yeah, uh, OTG, OTGing is really strong in this game because if you tech wrong, if you roll forward or back, you can do something like a down B. Universally, is probably going to catch. What is this catch. six second countdown? What's going to happen? Overdrive mode. Oh, that you get hit. Oh, oh DP. Oh, the follow up. That was level four. Oh, Yo, so it's the truth. Oh, activates overdrive. You get invincibility. What was that? Super Oh, anime. wow. It was like unlimited blade works. And then something else happened. Unlimited blade works. The cutlery. Yeah, I didn't know what was going on. I was like, oh, I don't know what's happening. Can I make everyone here feel old? What's up? 2018. It is the 10 year anniversary of when Blast Blue launched. Really? Yeah. Really? You know, I still have the, the PlayStation Collector's Edition that came with the DVD. It comes with a DVD with all the max damage combos and everything. What? I they still did that have back it. in the day? They did, and it comes in a huge box. It was so sick. 2008. How old would you say, Jam? Like four? Uh, we're close. <laughs> Probably still had facial hair. I'm pretty sure. I did, actually, yeah. <laughs> you were like a freshman, right, in high school? Yeah. 2008 was the year I started high school, yeah. Oh, so yeah, there you go. Yo, Rocket, oh, he's at the vertical oh, arm missiles? That's rolling. cheap. <laughs> Another international <laughs> match oh, versus Tutarupa. Oh, you guys are all in on USA, right? Obviously. You're Tutarupa? This. <laughs> Yo, oh, this is the character with the dog. That's actually yeah, cheap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody he, has has he, he has a pet dog. Yeah, it's he has the fight to assist. Yeah, I've seen this fair. one. Look at this pet dog out there. And he, he has his own arm that he shoots. Well, this is like a snout. He's hiding behind <laughs> his dog. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you got to, no, see, that's how it works. You got to knock the dog out. And then you got to go after him while the dog is down. That's the strategy, because now the dog is up. So you got to knock it down again. Oh, God. Oh, the oh, throw. Come here. Yeah, the knock dog. the dog down. A little robot dog. He's a, he's a little annoying. A trash dog. can. <laughs> cool, you can't, you can't just call someone's dog oh, a trash on. can. It's, it's like uh, Mega Man. He jumped on Robo. You can't call someone's dog a trash can, man. A little R2-D2 over here. This <laughs> Come on, man. Call his dog a trash can. <laughs> you never invited to my house. <laughs> never come call my dog a trash can ever again. I could never play this character, man. I would get so tilted oh, okay. when I people saw, hit okay. my I dog. I saw the face of the dog. In uh -huh. front. Was it in a trash can, Z? Not the front. <laughs> Just there the back. It is. It's cute. So you have to look at the opponent's screen to see the, the, dog, the dog face. That's so cute. I live in a trash can. <laughs> I live in a trash can. <laughs> oh, man. I like that reference. That was good. <laughs> That's all I can think about. <laughs> oh, in the corner. This does not look good. Oh, that's the yeah. dog. Yeah. Went for the throw. Yeah. Yep. Man, the USA getting freed up. Oh, no. You think PETA cares about this, this robotic dog? This, of course. <laughs> it counts. It counts. <laughs> all dogs, Steve. Oh, he's hiding behind the dog, using the dog as a meat I shield. Know. That's cowardly. <laughs> that's cowardly. <laughs> <laughs> Can't hide behind your dog like that. Using man's best friend. Well, the dog can use the tongue. Like a Yoshi. Why wouldn't you want to get like licked oh, by a robotic dog? I know. Right? <laughs> okay. Oh, the U.S. of A goes now. Man's best friend. It was a Labrador, not a Shiba. That's how you know. <laughs> it's the difference right there. Dang. 
Shivas are adorable. I, by I the way. swear to God, that was the next thing I was about to what? say. Shivas. Shivas are like actually next level. I, I think I follow like eight Shiva accounts on Instagram. I'm you have me lie. following Shiva Dude, accounts I, that's now. A I, that's dictator true. cosplay is on point. Where? Behind <laughs> you. <laughs> what? What? I don't know what's going on. Right, directly behind you. He really? definitely just oh, did. Oh, I, I see him. Yeah. <laughs> he yeah. actually just did. Cosplay psycho is a pressure. big uh, part of you know the culture here, of course. So this is a nice dictator, example of it. Dictator. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna jump back into some Street Fighter matches. I hear this is oh, the hammock! Yeah. I hear this is Tokido. This yeah. is Tokido, yeah. Highlight from Tokido. Dang, you okay. just drop the hammock on him? Versus Lei. So this is not Powell. This is somebody else. So Tokido carving his way through loser's bracket. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, standing medium kick. That was good. Like I'm fishing with that standing medium kick. How in his is Urian wearing this in the cold? I don't understand at all. <laughs> Dude, he's a god. Well, this doesn't bother him. Yes. You should be so honored to see all of this, you know? Are you oh, 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 oh. oh. Whoa. Whoa. What was that? A glancing that was kind of slick. The yeah, didn't get the uh, full hit of the mirror. Oof. If he dashed up, it might have worked. Tokido. Little, uh, oh, oh. Wait, did he in time? No. Oh, oh boy. What? What? Ooh. Okay, wow, okay, efficient meter game. <laughs> I think. That was scary. <laughs> yeah, I'm surprised he went for a win all in like that. That was crazy. Against the champ. He is up a game. Got some breathing room. True, but loser's bracket always dangerous. Yeah, no, you, you don't, don't want to play that game. You get hit once, bad news. No anti air from Tokido. Yeah, I feel like it takes a while for Tokido to get to like. DP anti air status. He, he he's all about ranging and knowing specifically that that DP is going to hit. He's very say, calculating. You can tell he's focused on the ground game, right? Interrupting the dashes with the crotch medium kick. Mm -hmm. That red fireball knockdown so off the HP uppercut. Oh, stand like kick. Wake light, up, clutch. Oh. Uh oh. Ooh, Set up zero. What is that? Throw. Yeah, you got to take the throw there. You bounce off the mirror. He gets a big combo. All right, EX DP. And Lay, he's been studying those tapes. You watch that Kenny Omega stream. He's figuring <laughs> things out here. Oh. EX tackle at the start. Classic oh. round opener. Ooh, oh, answers with a standard medium punch? He's yeah. like, no, nah, bro, you got to calm down. Yeah, welcome to Japan. Wake up standing medium punch. I love EX Demon Flip into V Skill to push to the corner. I think it's one of the coolest things. Oh! Do that. Yeah, but you can you can Testers, still quick please. tech that now, right? Really? You can quick tech the EX. Yes, you oh, can. Yeah, it's not a hard knockdown anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. to remove that 50-50 that uh, Akuma had. And you'd be surprised how many times that came up where you're like, oh crap, I can't quick tech. Oh, you got uh -oh. counter hit. What? Uh, mirrors out. Oh, oh, what was that? I can't believe he Slide jabbed the right there. Activation on that V trigger too. Oh, oh low profiles the head, but that's it. it. And Tokido cleans it up. A scrambly match, but he gets the job. Done. Nice thing about that feature trigger too is you can cancel an EX Demon Flip like five times. You just keep doing a bunch That's of EX wild. Demon Flips over and over and over because you do like standing fierce and if it's not cancelable you can just that V trigger on it. It's really good. I'd like to ask the game producers, why do they make some of the stronger characters stronger? The rich are getting richer, the fongs are getting fonger. They're they're mimicking life. <laughs> no, it is! It's, it's like a, a capitalist society in the uh, Street Fighter ecosystem. The fongs are getting fonger, huh? <laughs> So it's like oh, who is this? Oh, Kukuri. Kukuri. Yo, Kukuri? Kukuri is actually one of the oh, sickest man. character designs ever. Yeah. All right, tell me about it. He turns into sand, bro, and he makes wow. sand clones. You see that full screen projectile? He's like Gata? Yeah, he has yeah. like, and he has like these crazy ambiguous setups. Like it's so good. Oh, bait. Didn't take it. No activate. Look at him. What? That's wild. He's That's break dancing wild. on the sand. My I man. would actually dress like this guy. That's how cool he is. <laughs> that's how everybody's that's dressed outside. That's what MOV looks like. Yeah. That's why I'm. Uh, that's why I love MOV, man. Yeah. You have to dress like this outside. It's that's so an cool. overhead, He's by the way. He's got two actions he, in the air. He can oh, cancel yeah. that. That he can cancel that overhead action. This character's tight. Go you got for me. The slide. Billy Kane and oh. uh, Kukuri are. Right. Uh, I don't know about that. Uh, that whole a few meters. That lacy thing down the front, though. I don't know if you guys see this. He has like a drawstring to keep. It looks I, like Voldo if he stood up. That's <laughs> Look you know, at that pose. Did you know Rip, <laughs> you know Rip was a Vol, Voldo player? It made really? no sense to me. Yeah, yeah I, th I thought he was my friend, but I don't, I don't know if All I right, can get behind that. All right, here we go. Goose. Can't associate like that. The goose is loose. <laughs> loose. Got that air oh, fireball. Anchor goose. And you gotta, look, look at the ice yeah. cone. Yeah. The yeah. ice cone. The bunshin technique. Yeah, and you don't know what side. He can actually has like ambiguous mix-up. He can cancel Psycho the overhead crushing? and the teleport. Look at oh, that. Wow. Oh, wow. 
This character's so cool. Oh, he's trying to go for the reversal. He reads it. Quick dancing on the sand goes in the cancel. Dang, the psycho crusher, the sandal crusher. The, mm. Wait, are you telling me that things have hitboxes? Yes. The, the sand yes, clones have hit. hitboxes? The, the clones hit. This That's why absurd. He had to block it on the wake up right there, giving him a mix up. This character is sick. Yeah, Kukri is actually pretty good. All right, let's get into the second game. Holding yeah. strong now. Yeah, Kugri, one of the newer characters, uh, was a little bit underutilized at first just because it took some time to explore the character and develop tech for him. But now we, we see more and more Kukri's every tournament. Yeah, I'll, we, I'm, I'm telling you right now, I still they're still pretty rare. Yeah. But Kukri is definitely one, of, like you said, definitely one of the cooler new characters in the game. I like Benny Mars hair. I'm about it. <laughs> I'm, about, I'm definitely about it. Yo, the CBS2 intro, like when he wins and when he loses, he actually uses static electricity to put his hair up That's and down. That's wild. I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, you imagine how much hairspray that. that would take? <laughs> you would know, say, damn. You would definitely know. I don't know. hate hairspray. I'm not about that life, so I understand. If I had electricity, I'd use it too. I didn't think I have to touch my hair so much. It doesn't stay in place because hairspray is whack. <laughs> Cover just in time Ooh. on the crouch seat and gets the back throw. Yeah. Reading the roll, gets the blowback, that lightning kick. I like the crouch beat. Tries to go for a mix-up mid-screen right after. That's what you want to do. That's why short hopping is so good. I like those early jump back normals just to catch people trying to, you know, short hop on your move forward trade. And the jump normals from Betty Marble are ridiculous. And B and D. And it's because he can cancel in the fireball. So if you try to, like, chase after him, he can cancel in the air fireball and make you respect it even more. All right, here we go. King. Nice wall bounce. Yeah, CD properties in this game can give you, like, wall splats now. So you now get combos, just in case you guys aren't familiar. Yeah, exactly. That's why. From long distance like that, you're just going to get, like, a fireball follow-up or something. But, yeah, uh, or a charge super if somebody has it. Correct. Oh, nice. That will finish the job. Level 2 super. King, such a cool character. Yeah, King traditionally one of the best keep-away characters Ooh. in the game. Here we go again. Cougar. See my boy come in from nowhere. Sand, and from somebody sand. dumped an hourglass on the ground and he just came out like, yeah. And just activated Max in the neutral. Oh. And I like that Tatsu to stop all of that. What is that, a teleport? Yeah. The multiple sand the, clones? Yeah, it's the EX sand clone. You, you, uh, you guys definitely got me with the break dancing sand and the cycle crusher. <laughs> like, you got me right there. That's the point of no return. Look, oh, he's break dancing on the sand into a cycle crusher. Like, what else could I ask for? That's actually pretty sick. Oh, oh. Jump air air. Those pants are cool too. Man, his, he's just man, he's, a cool he's just a, such a cool character. Yeah, he's a cool character. Come on. The goose. Immediately <laughs> air air again. Opens him up for a quick level one. It's really cool. Okay, we'll have to add a Tekken character to this game. Guard your legs, bro. The fake out. No. Oh, oh. You know, yeah, you can't counter that, my man. Dang, the way he took him out from the leg is a weird spot. He grabs spot. one leg, sweeps under him, throws him the other way. Kukri is actually pretty dope. All right, we, uh, I believe we saw this Akuma player lose to uh, Yukadon earlier, I believe. Mm -hmm. yeah. Taiga uh, Goki. Oh, no, Antia. Probably not prepared for it. EX Demon Flip. I like the patience. A lot of Ken players are saying, why play Ken? If you could, uh, if Goki's in the game, he's just a superior Shoto all around. That's what I keep hearing. Oh, DP. Yeah, dash four pressure, not as good. Ooh, oh, he's ready for guard. that. Taiga uh, was a Yun player in four. I remember actually. Now that you mention it, yeah. yeah. Oh, throw back into the corner. That's the part. Get dangerous close. That triggered too. Ooh, yeah. the volcano. Built it on Ooh. the last hit. Smoke him. No, no uh, juggle anymore. Three framer missed it. Oh, boom! Trying to stay alive. Ooh. Dash up. I thought that was a throw. He's got the CA on deck. Oh. Oh, he was going. He was looking for a confirm. He oh, was yeah. looking for a confirm. Oh yeah. One of that down strong probably or the down medium kick. Either one. Both of them are really uh, good confirms for Ken into that critical art when he's got it on deck. So there it is. We got a little uh, KOF action, a little bit of uh, Street Fighter action. What are you doing over there, Z? Just finding out some information. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. It's over there typing up. Uh, I'm trying reviews. to order some hot water. Oh, I knew it. So we can uh, get some of these noodles. He's out actually pre-ordering that DBFZ. He wants the blue. 
Goku blue, Vegeta blue. You know, I saw a tweet today from uh, L.I. Joe. You brought him up earlier talking about it. He said, I think the blue-haired ones aren't as good as the yellow-haired. Oh, come version. on, bro. What? Come on, Does bro. He, he, said, well, he said in terms well, of gameplay. Is he talking about, he's talking about gameplay. Instinct? No, he's talking about the gameplay. Oh, man. Okay. And uh, I thought it was really interesting because I thought to myself, Joe might not actually know the difference between the yellow and the blue. He, he, he might not understand. He said he never watched Dragon Ball. And that's okay. Wow. Hold on. I want to thank you for bringing that up. That's okay. That's you okay. Watch... You're going to sit next to me in Japan and tell me not watching Dragon Ball is okay? We While welcome he's wearing you. a Dragon Ball shirt. While he's wa wearing we a Dragon you. Ball shirt. He's the official ambassador. Let him speak. We welcome you with arms. You don't have to be a total weeb. We are, want are you calling me a weeb right now? Yes. yes, absolutely. And I yeah, am too. I wear it proudly. But what I'm saying is we should be welcoming all these people that come from... It was just like when Street Fighter 4 came out, right? And we welcome you with open arms, whether or not you... Play arms or Know the ball. difference between, <laughs> like, young Gohan, old Gohan, what happened. No, that's true. I mean... If you just want to play it for a fighting game, you're more than welcome to. That's all I'm saying. There's a lot of people coming into Dragon Ball, you're right. And I, I completely agree. It, it's, it's an open arm scenario, and I feel like... It we welcome throws that people Frieza off. behind <laughs> us, too. Yeah, Frieza helped us find a hedgehog cafe the other day. Yeah, that oh, was that's true. Yeah. Sorry, you were saying. I completely forgot what I was about to say. I got too hype about the Frieza. No, so me. the reason why I bring this up is because I see on Twitter okay. a lot of elitism, right? Oh, if you weren't, if you didn't see Dragon Ball, not even Z, like Dragon Ball. Oh, the original, the regular yeah, one, yeah. A little That's baby not cool. Going. That's not cool. It's like, oh, you can't be playing this game. And I'm like, you don't own this. The only person that, that maybe has that power is, like, Toriyama. Yeah. Right? Uh, but I'm, I'm sure he wants everyone to play the game. So let's just be grateful that there is now a unifying force mm -hmm. among the very disparate uh, and warring tribes of the fighting game communities. And now we have something to bring us together. So, like, lend your Genkidama uh, ah. energy, spirit energy, to the FTC. <laughs> no, you're right. And Toriyama came back and created Android 21 yes. specifically for Dragon Ball Fighters. He knows what fighters. he's doing. He knows what he's doing. <laughs> so the I, color palette, by the color palette alone, he knows what he's doing. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Something for everyone. Hello, and 21, we, I was like, uh-huh. And we were talking about whoever's yeah. running, that account who's running oh, like, oh, man, fire. they're too good. They're too good. Hit me up. That, that, that person is ridiculous. Hit me up. There it is. The Fongs get Fong, or as uh, Z mentioned earlier, Kuze Fong. Oh, and he's rocking his V-Trigger 2 as well. Mm, yeah, interesting, actually. I was surprised. A lot of people like a uh, new V-Trigger 1 because it gives that uh, V-Skill a hurtbox, or a hitbox, so that uh, you have to deal with it like a normal fireball. Yo, have you seen when my man pulls the sleeves back? Yeah. It is a scary sight. Yeah. yeah it's it's kind of creepy. He's got, like, baby hands, man. It's weird. <laughs> I, I like it better when the sleeves are on. Yeah. Reminds me, Z, what, what is your man playing these days? Is he going to be playing some Fong this weekend? Uh, Sien? Yeah. He's a current Ibuki V Trigger 2, and but he knows there's no. Uh, he probably can't main the character if he wants to do big damage in the big tournaments. Mm. Man, look at these hands. That is creepy. <laughs> what? Oh. Yeah. What is that? Little crystals. It's a poison tip fingers, man. Sorry, he applies the poison. He wants you to take the poison. He's so dainty. Yeah, I don't like I it think at all. Is, I don't know. There's something uh, I feel creepy. Like the arms, the flesh has been corroded yeah. away by the poison. Yeah, I like that uh, when he lost there, the sleeves came back up. He's much better like this. I, th I think Fong has a really cool character design overall. Definitely one of my favorite like new generation Street Fighter characters. They took him right out of Kung Fu Hustle. Yeah, yeah he is, so he is the guy who plays the, the, the instrument in Kung Fu Hustle. Who didn't oh. have the reaction oh, nice. to uh, interrupt, but yeah, still good block. Oh, Shin is actually defense is looking good. Yeah, there's a lot of time where you just sort of have the block against this character, wow. right? Yeah, hits behind the head. I thought they got nerfed. The back strong? Yeah, I got nerfed a little. It trades a lot more than it used to. Wow, it's oh. here. Out of the uh, coward crowd. Oh boy. Kami uh, made the A tier for the Topanga list on that chalkboard. So she's still a very formidable character in their opinion. Well, back strong trade. Yeah, see that trade. Maybe it wouldn't have traded low. before. Yeah, but before it might have worked, but you know, he uh, he lands off the whip dive kick, gets the back throw anyway, so it works out. Fong is one of those characters that forces you to block a long time, but a lot of the times it doesn't turn into meaningful damage or anything. So you just kind of sit there, block out the plus frames, wait it out, and say, all right, well, here we go. Now I'm just going to take my turn, get my opportunity, and add on a little bit more damage. Oh, gets the jump again. Yeah, applied the poison as well. V-reversal, good choice to uh, remove it and also escape the corner. Oh, oh wow. wow. 
Wow, reversal knees. Opens him up with a crotch jab. Slowly pushes to the corner. Wake up back, though. Yeah, that crotch and jab series is better from Kami in this season as well. You see, he tried for the meaty throw. They did get an increase of the active frames on it, but still missed. Oh, wow. Who's yeah, it? This is a dangerous position against Fong. He has good round closers. A lot of far-reaching normals like you saw there. Yeah, he's got his crou crouching uh, line kick, crouching jab, the instant overhead he has available. Oh, yeah, there nice. it is. I love the attempted answer with the crouch jab like you saw uh, coming from Oshin. That was actually pretty smart. Didn't work out, but it was a good answer. Just to stop that pressure. Fong's up-close pressure is really good using that canceling into Kyle Crouch just to make it continue to block. Yeah, there's a lot of, a lot of times where you just have to respect those plus frames, mm -hmm. right? Unless you want to wild out with a DP or something like that. Okay, push to the corner again. V reversal. Yeah, both of these characters have escape V reversals. Ooh, wow, that's a new conversion. Gets the throw this time, didn't even attempt to come. Boy, a factor, stun. Jump in. All right, cruise, hey. Ties the set, 1-1. One, one. What a turnaround. Yeah, with this Fong play and V trigger two on top of that, which is cool to see. A lot of people so far have been playing trigger one still, uh, but it's cool to see people experiment and try new stuff. Yeah, I guess the incre the enhanced poison. Dude, look how big that jacket is. <laughs> Man, try to keep warm. Gotta stay warm out here. It's cold in these streets. It definitely is. He also gets the command dash, I believe, cancelable off the fireballs on V Trigger 2. Yeah, it just buffs all of his moves in general, right? Makes them uh, really, really powerful. Ooh, oh, interruption. Tries to go for a throw. Good answer. Knocked down. I like that. Dead body push to the corner. Taking this throw series. This is where Kami excels, right? Corner position, knockdown. The pressure here is really tough for this character to deal with. That was a beautiful slum now. Activation. That's a setup. In the front. Oh, try to bait something out. Still gets hit by that crouch jab. Oh, a little mini shimmy there. Yep. Two in that round that closed that out. Pretty, pretty key there. Just the uh, oh, hands. Closing out that round, Cammy. Match point now. Max strong. Clutch oh, anti air. Cash under two. Going to be corner position already. Fong has V reversal available, oh, but just uh, slides out. Definitely one of the better tools he has to, to get away from pressure. Oh, that coward crouch into kick. It's close for him. Oh, holds back. I can see Kuze trying to bait something out from the cami, but not taking a bait. Oh, crush counter. See if the setup pays off? No. Now one hit can be KO here with that V-Trigger on deck from Cami and CA. Dash up. Oh, coward oh, crouch under. Dude, right the low there. profile. Again. Gets the throw this time. Back in the middle screen. He's trying to take this to a final round. Blocking forever. V-Trigger still active for Cammy. Oh, oh the sick. dash up, brave, instant overhead, jump back. Yeah, great round closer from Fong. He's got good low, good safe lows and a good instant overhead. I like the jump back. And the evasiveness from Fong. He's running, trying to avoid uh, scrapping straight up with Cammy. Oh, wow. Right. Gets the throw. Oshan with a, with a tick throw of his own. Beats the dive kick out of the corner. Solid escape option and the sweep. Yeah, it looked like it was uh, mostly safe there. Down yeah, backing a lot back oh. in the middle of the screen. Confirm. Use those knees. Oh, tries to go for it again. Crouching strong, activating the trigger. Yeah, saves the second activation here. V trigger available. Standing. Maybe nice. the setup will work. Oh, back throw. That poison adding up. Oh, oh why would you trade attack? with the poison. No reversal. Is that a reversal? Oh, what? the punish. Yo, that was actually pretty dope. Tries to throw down the trap at the last possible second. That was wild. Reversal punish. Nice work. This is why there's like three people <laughs> in the fighting game community that use Fong. Yeah. But in the real world, there are millions. <laughs> They've got that. F-A-N-G, right? Facebook, Apple, Netflix, and Google. He's top, top, top tier in the real world, but in the game, bottom. Oh.
Could you live without those four companies? I don't think so. No, right? not judging Come about on, my phone. Come on, you have your phone? <laughs> no, no. Yeah, I don't, I don't think yourself. I could either. Net, without Netflix, what would we do? Without Google? There would be no chill. Apple? Yeah, there would be no chill. <laughs> there would be no chill. I like, need the chill. No, just kidding. What am I supposed to do <laughs> with my no life? <laughs> <laughs> see, see his realization. That was a slow burn. Like, oh my God. God. That was a slow burn. That, that, you mean there's no chill at all? No, like that. I'm not allowed to just hang out. No, so the human population would would halt right there. And yeah, that extinct? would be the end. Yeah, what were we okay. supposed to do after that? Well, either way, we're gonna head to a short break. We'll be back with more Evo Japan 2018 action in just a little bit.